Rose, and welcome to My Randomosity. Before I get into an actual current video, um, I just want to announce that I do have a giveaway that's going on on my channel because I recently reached 300 subscribers, and at the very top of the description box, there will be a link to that video. Click on it, listen to all the instructions if you would like to enter that giveaway. Okay, this is my video on my October Julep Maven box, and I actually have a very interesting box. I went with the Modern Beauty box, which is technically no nail polish, um, just beauty products, but then I added on three nail polishes that I wanted. What is Julep Maven? Well, if you don't know by now, you should check out a couple links that I'll have labeled down in the description bar. Um, some blogs and vlogs that I've made where I describe the program extensively. To sum it up, it is a monthly beauty subscription service that costs $19.99. These nail polishes, which are sold on um, Sephora, QVC, uh, they retail for $14 each, so $19.99 for more than one nail polish, a really good deal. Um, now this program is really unique because the boxes they offer are different. The way you, um, you actually have a choice with your boxes, you get to see them in advance, and the program is actually skippable, so no commitment. Now if you're interested, because you know enough about Jolette Maven, and if you're interested in actually joining, um, you can join one of two ways. I will have this section again labeled in the description box. You can either go to my blog where I've written about this box and I have like um, more detailed like unboxing pictures. Um, at the very top of the blog there's a julep banner. Um, you can click on that and that banner actually shows you the promo code to use to get your first box for free. Or you can just use my referral link if you'd rather not go to my blog and I will have that listed again with the promo code. Now before I get into the box, I normally thank individually um, everyone that I know because I'm notified through the Julep website whenever someone uses my link. And someone that I failed to thank in my last video, I can't recall what your last name is, I believe it starts with a G, but I know your first name is Rachel. Thank you so much for joining, I definitely appreciate it. And then kind of like an extended friend, a friend of a friend that actually joined within the past couple weeks, Daniel Duncan. If you're watching this, thank you for joining. I definitely appreciate it. Um, using my referral link, of course, is something that you don't have to do, so I definitely um, try to show my gratitude to everyone that, that uses it by thanking you guys individually. So let me actually get into my box. Now, I noticed my box was slightly larger, um, mainly because normally with Julep, when you get your box and if you add on extra products, they normally send those in a separate shipment. Why, well, I guess now maybe they're saving on cardboard because I have a much bigger box because that sticker basically says how my add-ons are included inside. And then when I open the box, I see that it's labeled Modern Beauty because that's the box that I went with. And then everything is kind of wrapped in this very fall themed bronze tissue paper. And then when I unfold it, everything, this is basically what it looked on the inside. First thing I see is another, like, food information card. So that basically told me how there's candy corn in this box, which I'm actually not a huge fan of, so I would be giving that to a friend. Actually, there is the candy corn. And then the cool little quote card that they have is a Joan Jett quote, and it says, don't ask permission. Pretty good quote. Now, before I show you my add-ons, I'll go ahead and show you what was included in the Modern Beauty Box. Um, the makeup item was a Kajal, Kajal Eye Glider, 0.13 ounces, and this is a double-sided eyeliner, and I believe it includes a sharpener, too paraben-free, sulfate-free, and then that is the box that it comes in. And let me just read you the information. It says, two intensely pigmented colors that glide on smoothly and blend like a dream. 
ideal for tight lining between eyelashes, lining inner rims, and creating smoky eyes. This ophthalmologist tested pencil won't drag or pull on delicate, delicate skin, sharpener included. And it says the color is carbon black and brown shimmer. Alright, that is a nice sharpener. There's that opening, and then it has, um, it's encased, so no mess. That's pretty neat. And then here's the eyeliner. I'm not going to swatch these only because I don't want to, like, don't want these to lose their freshness, but it's basically color-coded, the two colors, and that is obviously the black end. And then that is the brown shimmer. Okay, the other product was really my real motivation for picking this box because I've always wanted to try a black charcoal mask. But this is the Mask Noir, a peel-off mask with power cell complex, two and a half ounces. And it says, lift away impurities with this antioxidant-rich peel-off mask. Enhanced with Julet's propri proprietary power cell complex, an age defying blend of rosehip seed oil, Malvis, Malvasi, Malvasi, lipid extract, and green coffee bean oil. This transforming mask removes dull cells and debris, leaving your skin smoother, brighter, and deeply hydrated. It says to leave on for 15 to 20 minutes, gently peel, yada yada yada. But this is the box. I will put what the value of it is. And then that's the tube. Can't wait to try this. And let me get into the fun part. The add-ons. Now, I really want to try, again, like I said, the Modern Beauty box for that mask. And then I can always use a Kajal eyeliner. Or a Kajal eyeliner. But, like... The formations of the different nail polish boxes, there there would be like one that I would like, but then I wouldn't care for the others. So basically I decided just to pick the three that I like the most, and I chose those to be the add-ons. Now this is the new packaging for the nail polishes. They actually come in a sleeve, and they come in these white boxes now. And actually, I'm going to just leave these in the boxes because you can clearly see the color. But this first one is stunning. It's Sierra. And it's like this purple base, purpley maroon base, but it has duochrome teal and purple glitter. Now, I think you definitely can see that with the light flashing in my camera. So pretty. Now, this next one is Beatrix. Now, this is, I believe when this is swatched, the base is more sheer. But when I hold this up, it's going to look like a black base. But keep in mind, it's more sheer. But it has, like, different sizes of holographic glitter in it. Now, this is gorgeous. Can't wait to layer that over a dark polish. Actually, I think it would look good with the navy polish that I have on right now. And the last one I'm very excited about. This is Casper, or how I like to say. Casper. That was so awful. But basically I like to say it like I'm Ben Affleck with a Boston accent. Uh, a good college friend of mine that used to be a roommate, that was the name of her car. So... I just can't say Casper normal. I have to say Casper. But anyway, this is actually a glow in a dark polish. And I think in order for this to work properly, you need to keep it out and expose the light. I tested this out though. In a black light, it automatically glows very bright, of course. Um, now in darkness, when I initially held this up in the dark, it glowed, you know, okay, only because this has been inside my black jewel box for the last few days. Um, but if you keep it out, exposed to light, it will glow very bright on your nails in darkness. And then, I will hold these up again so you can see them in their glory. 
And that is everything in my box. I will go ahead and tell you what the value of it is. And while I stay a member for November, of course, Julep is one of my favorite beauty subscription services. Honestly, before I joined, I never wore nail polish. Like, I hadn't worn it since high school, which was a long time ago. And only because these polishes are such good quality, such beautiful colors, it has turned me into the nail junkie that I am now. Now, in my last Julep video, which was my late July one, I, like, reviewed so many polishes that I've worn over the last seven months or six months. Um, this is one that I left out. Only because she will remain unnamed, but a family member used this. Basically almost used a third of this bottle. And she just kind of stuck this somewhere because it was dried out. It wasn't closed all the way, which I'm not very happy about. Um, but I noticed this since I filmed my last Julep video, so I feel like I need to show this to you. Keep in mind that the top layer of this is dried out. I'm not very happy about it. But this was Vivian. Um, and it was like a holographic, multi-dimensional, multi-sized, shimmering gold polish. But if you look at this top part, completely dried out. Very sad, not very happy. But this is it for my October Juliet video, a video that's on a monthly uh, beauty subscription service that's actually on time, which is amazing. I've actually had this box for like two weeks now, and I've just now had the chance to film it, because uh, again, I've been busy. Some new recent changes in my life. But anyway, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask in a comment or message, and that is it. Again, this is Rose from My Randomosity, and thank you so much for watching this crap. Um, you can follow me on Twitter or Instagram, and my username is at Rose Jarman. And until next time, I hope you have a great day, and you'll be seeing me again very soon. And I promise you, within the next couple of weeks, I will put up at least one Halloween makeup tutorial, so stay tuned for that. Thank you.